Yep, Night Beater is mate. Missed the chance of a lifetime. Chance of a lifetime. Especially because I didn't see it. That's the other thing. Like, there, I might take some risk if I'm lost where I maybe allow something, but I didn't even see it. So, yeah, it really was a once in a lifetime chance. Okay, let's play Bishop F3, put pressure on the diagonal. Play bishop g3, try to hit the pawn on c7. Um, what else would you pressure on other than diagonal? That's true, yeah, with only bishops, I don't really have a choice. Um, I'll take, I'll take. I mean, it's a little bit dangerous for black. Like, bishop b3 is coming, bishop a4. Okay, try to play bishop a4 and play around with this pin here. So go bishop a4. If bishop c6, I'll take and go bishop d1. Idea to play bishop a4, take advantage of the pin coming up here. And I'm not even sure actually how black can stop this pin. It's really, really dire. Yeah, king e7 is a move, but then bishop a4 followed by bishop d6 is really, really dangerous too. I think that's already close to loss for black. I'll pre-move bishop c7. I don't think he'll take, but I'll pre-move it. Hammer would love this position as white. So many bishops. Yeah, so many bishops. Everybody loves them some bishops, eh? Um, how's it going, Sengar Baron? Hope you're... Uh, Hope you're having a good evening in, in France. Thank you to Nickel Farron for the 200 bits as well. Much appreciated. <sighs> are you really at a disadvantage with so many bishops? You definitely are if they know how to play the first about five to six moves, but otherwise uh, it can change really fast. Chess on Earth says, thank you for the yawn, Hikaru. Much appreciated. Like I said, I've been up since 5 a.m., so I've been awake for, uh, I've been awake for, uh, quite a while. Doan does says, why did you move to Florida? I got sick and tired of the cold weather on the east coast of the U.S. Um, that's number one. I got tired of, uh, of all the unfortunate taxes that they try to cheat you out, you know, that they try to hit you with on the east coast of the United States as well. Um, and third, I just need to be close to an airport, and I still have to be on the east coast, so... It makes the most sense to be in Florida. So that's checkmate, of course. Do I speak any German? Nine. Okay, I can play E6 or D4. Actually, wait, what are the odds? Oh, there are no odds. Just Oh, I'm playing time. No, no time odds. Oh, oh I'm playing 30 seconds. Okay, I got to go fast. Got to go really fast. Play bishop g4. Ah, he played bishop b2, which tricked me. I wasn't expecting that. So now I take, I've got queen h4, maybe bishop f4 also. I'll probably take, I'll take, I'll take. Okay, let's play queen h6, threat and checkmate. If g3, just bishop e3 and the pin is good. I'll pre move, okay, bishop e3. Fate, rook f2 coming. Oh, this is just not good enough. My checkmate. So another win.
Okay, so now we're playing a Ledang. We're playing with two pawn odds. This is actually not huge odds here because the bishops are going to be amazing on diagonals. Maybe I'll play rook g1. Yeah, definitely I'm going to play rook g1 here. Play d3, maybe knight d2, e4. Let's go e4 now. Uh, that's a free pawn. I'm going to grab it. Let's go e4. Did I misdiscover his bishop h2 last game? No, I mean, I could have done it, but queen h6 was better than bishop h2. Oh, I hung a rook. Oh my gosh. Oh, jeez. Um... Oh, I think you mad Queen Dog for the three month resub. Not half naked anymore and suck it, Kevin. You can't sub me. I don't know what that means. That sounds kind of kinky or weird. I don't even know. That just sounds weird. Uh, let's just play Queen E4. Um, so I'll play uh, Knight D2 here, I guess. Uh, I can play Queen E3, I guess. Um, so I guess F4. You guys are just like getting all, all weird weird in here. Um, so it is what it is. Okay, place knight before. That's a free pawn, which I'm going to grab. Now I've got checkmate coming. <laughs> getting weird in here. It's getting weird. Hikaru is uncomfortable now. Good job. Yes, I'm so uncomfortable. Like I've never, I've never had such thoughts in my life. This is all like, I'm very pure. I'm so pure. I hung a rook. My wife should leave me. It was not, a, it was not a free rook on G7, by the way. Um, I think Black's getting checkmated here, almost by force. La Granja or Polo Trafic, Polo Tro, Pollo Tropical. I haven't been to either one of those. I, I mean, I know people go to po Pollo Tropical, but I've never been there. Thank you, Chastity, for giving us the Goon Recruiter. Obviously, I just take the knight. It's still on. Black's still unable to stop checkmate here. <clears throat> Angel. Yes, Bishop V8 was playable, but it leads to checkmate. Have I been to Cuba yet? No, I haven't been to Cuba. All right, you guys, I think I'm going to take a short break and go use the restroom. Um, we're an hour in, so I'm just going to go use the restroom. I'm actually feeling rather sleepy, so I'm going to probably make some more coffee. So, um, so, uh, so yeah, I'll be right back.
All right, what's up, everybody? We are back, 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 back in black. Um, okay, so, all right. Oh, what just happened? Did I just get unplugged? One sec. Okay, let's just play Bish page six. Whoa, thank you to Kevin C. Wong. Thank you to Kevin C. Wong for the 500 gifted subs. Thank you so much, my friend. Much appreciated. Okay, uh, let's just take and play Queen E3. Oh, wait, I thought he was going to take with a knight. Let's Queen E3, okay. Anyway, thank you to Kevin C. Wong for the five gifts of subs. Really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Okay, let's lurk G1. This actually is not so easy for, for black here. I'm seven points down and I offer an exchange. Oh, look, it's chess. What do you want from me? Okay, let's take and castle here. Okay, plays E5. Uh, what does this do? I'm gonna go knight e2 here. Try to keep some tricks here with the knight. Knight f5, knight h5. Can I blunder his knight h5? I don't know if it really does anything, but I'm gonna try to make it work. Okay, king f8 is surprising. Let's check and go knight g7. Queen f6. Um, oh, he's threatening. Oh, he's got knight b3 mate. Oh my gosh, he had knight b3 checkmate. I'm blind. Knight b3 is just checkmate. Oh my gosh. Okay, now he sees it, but it's too late. He missed it. It's too late. It's too little, it's too late, right? Okay, there we go. Let's make a check. I've got Rook F7 coming. Let's make a check. Queen H7, hit the Rook, hit the Pawn. Now check mate. I think that's a fitting song because he missed me eight and one and then it's like it's just it's too little too late after that Thank you to Lucky and Forellos uh, for the sub with Twitch Prime. Thank you so much. He had the once in a lifetime opportunity to checkmate me. He did, and he missed it. Knight B3 is checkmate in one. Yes. Yes. Yep. Yep. In this position, Knight B3 is checkmate. King has no squares. Yep. Knight B3 is mate. Missed the chance of a lifetime. Chance of a lifetime, especially because I didn't see it. That's the other thing. Like, there, I might take some risk if I'm lost, where I maybe allow something, but I didn't even see it. So yeah, it really was a once in a lifetime chance. Cool cup. It's just a, it's just a normal coffee cup that I have. Uh, bought in Vancouver. I think I saw it being sold at the. Uh, I think I saw this cup being sold in um, at uh, the Field Museum. I think it was in in Chicago as well. Um, but yeah. Grandmaster Gallery says, I'm in Chicago. Chi-Town's great. I love Chicago. But again, Chicago is taxes that, you know, you pay taxes out of the you-know-what, and that's just not acceptable. Play some queen? I can play some queen. You want some queen? There we go. Just take...
Maybe queen h5 next move, hit, put pressure on the pawn f7. Crazy little thing called love. D5 is a great move. I was not expecting him to play D5. That's kind of annoying. Um, who do I think is going to qualify for the Canis? Well, it's pretty straightforward. I mean, I think the winner of the match between uh, uh, Jan and Maxime qualifies, unless I'm mistaken. Where is Dania? Dania is playing a tournament in, I want to say in Dallas. That's a terrible move. Now he loses to Bishop on G7. Um, uh, Dania is playing a tournament in Dallas, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. But I could be wrong. I think I think it's in Dallas. Just take. Hello, he get is dear. Yeah, I believe that means how are you um, in German, if I'm not mistaken. Not that I've really studied German, but I think that means uh, how are you in German. Um, okay, I think I can just trade and play rook h7. Hola, Icaro. Como esta? Bien, bien, gracias. Y tú? Um, anyway, if knight f6 just rook h4, I don't really speak German, but I do know some basic phrases in German. I will say that. Um, Japanese, I spoke Japanese last stream. Not really in the mood right now. Um, thank you for the 200 bits from Grandmaster Gowry. Thank you so much. Um, I can play f4, queen f3. The only language, I mean, I will say this. The only languages that I've really studied formally are Japanese and French. Spanish... I didn't really study Spanish formally. Spanish I studied a little bit, but the only ones that I actually like studied from textbooks were Japanese and French. Chinese, what do you want? You want me to speak Cantonese? I mean, I, I don't like Mandarin. I'm, I mean, I'm obviously a big like, I, I, you know, I like, I like the Cantonese people in Hong Kong and Vancouver a little bit more than the mainlanders, if I may say so. Maybe that'll get me into some, some kind of trouble, but you know, it's the truth. Um, so I mean, I I, I I love the Cantonese people. They're they're they're, they're my peoples. They really are. Um, let's play d5. Uh, that's just a free piece. This guy's wife should leave him. He hung a knight and he hung a uh, bishop on g4 too. You can't hang two pieces for free in a game as a 2000. That's just like not acceptable. Um, all right, next game coming up. I mean, 2000 hanging two pieces. Okay, now this is queen odds. So. Uh, a little bit different, but if you hang two pieces as a 2,000, like, there's, I mean, uh, it's just not very good. Put A3. Uh, Punisher wrote, wrote uh, something that he meant to write in French, but VU is not VU. It'd be, uh, it'd be V-O-U-S in this case, um, and then voulez vu. It would, again would not be VU, it was V-O-U-S. Or no, sorry, it's voulez. It's V-O-U-L-E-Z, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, on the first one. Then it's, uh, it's voulez, and then it's, then it's V-O-U-S. Um, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's V-O-U-L-E-Z and then it's V-O-U-S. Yeah, yeah, that's, I, I realized after a second that's what it is. Um, and Couché, of course, C-O-U-H-E-Z. Avec moi. I think you spelled avec moi correctly. My French, actually, my French grammar is terrible. I can speak it a lot better than I can write it. Is the car's English perfect? I'm not an English major, if that's your question, but I definitely am a native English speaker, so I'd hope my English is somewhat decent. What, you want, you want to hear some French? Okay, we'll play a French song. You guys want French? There you go. Chesapeake's gonna hate me for this, but it is what it is. Let's play Bishop B2. Oh, I can take, I can play knight b5 also. Let's play bishop b1. I'm not speaking French, yes. I, this song I don't know by heart though. I mean, I can play something. I can play, um, what can I play? I allowed something bad here, but. Um, <laughs> this song reminds me of my disgusting French teacher. I don't really know what that's supposed to mean. Disgusting French teacher. That does not sound good. 
That does not sound good at all. But anyway, okay, we'll, we'll change it to something else. Um, something a little bit more chill and happy. My French teacher was something, yeah. Was, was she an au pair as well? Like, let's play rook d4 here. <laughs> uh, I can play bishop f3 next move. Um, <laughs> maybe king d2 as well. Uh, or bishop f3. <laughs> let's play rook d1. <laughs> okay, let's play rook f4. I'm having too much fun now. Sorry about that. Um, let's go king d2. <laughs> Uh, let's play bishop c3, hit the queen on e5. <laughs> uh, I'm going to play h4, hit the queen again. Let's just take the pawn on g7. Uh, uh, let's play bishop f6, hit the rook on d8. Bishop d4. So I'm down a queen for a piece here, but I've got two good bishops. Where's the beard? Um, I don't have a beard. I need to shave it. I, it's been, I've had it for too long. It's been over a month. It's getting a little bit itchy and annoying. Um, so yeah, just need to get rid of it. Okay, that's a terrible move. I'm going to take the rook on h7 now. Okay, I go rook g4. If the queen moves, he loses the rook. He can't really protect it from h8 either. So he either has to sack the queen for the rook or move the queen off and give the rook for free. Why have you shaved? Have you stopped drinking? Um, maybe. Okay, let's play rook a1. Let's go king d1. Threatening bishop a7, bishop e5 check. It's hard to defend the pawn with the king on b8 as well. I look 10 years younger. Thank you so much. That's also not a good move. Now I just take with check. He hangs the queen on b4. How old is my brother? He's two years older than me. Let's make a check. Trade the rooks. 